Okay, everybody. I'm gonna be making some fish and some vegan lasagna. Okay, so right now what I'm doing is I'm throwing out the fish, getting it a little soft so that it can go into the uh, cornmeal. Okay, I'm gonna place the whole this camera while I do this now. Take my knife and slip it. So now the fish is nice and soft because if the fish ain't soft, it can't really go into the corner properly. So, like the corner can't really stick, you know. So, here we are. Use the corner to the fish. Usually, I like to use a spoon and like move it around that way it can stick properly. But as you can see, it's thick. There you go. And we're going to come over here and place it into the... Place this into the fire that's already prepared. It's already warmed up. Okay? So I'm going to do that for each one of them. I'm making vegan lasagna, so anybody that's vegan, understand that you can still have a good meal, but I'm also, I also eat fish. So here we go, we got got six fish, once again, place it into the cornmeal, and place it on the fryer. Okay? We're just repeating the process. Take the process, place it on the fire. So this is the fish right now, fine. Okay. Um, the oil that I'm using is an organic oil. So it's totally organic. This is the oil. This is a very good oil. I got about eight fish in here. I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. There we go. This is tilapia, guys. Tilapia. Um, a lot of people like salmon, but I don't really like salmon too much just because it's a little bit saltier. And um, I don't, I don't know. You know, that's just my opinion. This is a little bit salty for me. <laughs> it's the salt for me. That's the only reason why I don't like salmon as much. So I usually stick with tilapia. I'm not saying that it's the healthier route or anything. I just usually stick with it just because I don't really like um, a lot of salt. So we roll it around and once again my hands are clean. That we do. And we place it with the rest of it. Okay. Oops. Drop over the oil. Put it on. Let's clean that up real quick. So usually what I do is I cook, I try to cook every day because I don't like to eat leftovers. Leftovers sometimes has like, I don't know, you know, for me, I have a couple of conditions like having miles and things like that. So you see how soft this is now? This is super soft, nice, this is very nice, nice texture. So that it can easily, look at this one. Easily soak up the cornmeal. If it's hard, it ain't gonna soak up the cornmeal. 
something. That's definitely something that you should know. Okay, so just good. Let the throw this in the garbage. Okay. I haven't been on for a while, but I'm back. I would like everybody to just share the video. Subscribe to the channel, please. Okay, so I'm, I'm constantly just putting it in a little bit of the hot water. It's like warm water, really. It's warm. So now I'm going to put that in the cornmeal, place it on the fire. I lost my knife in the oh, okay, we go. <laughs> I lost my knife in the <laughs> um, Put it in the cornmeal. This one in the cornmeal. I'm not sure what you guys can really see because I put this one more so up on to the glass stuff, the, 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 like the little stand. But, you know. As you can see, just give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I'd appreciate it. Thank you very much. There we go. Next window of fish going up in the cornmeal. I'm going to throw this out now. So, taking it over here. Here we are. We're going to start to mix it. My hands are clean once again. We're mixing the fish in. Um, some people are pescatarians. I believe that's what it's called. Pescatarians. And that's what, you know, at one point, I was going to be, be vegan, okay? Because I have, like, neuropathy and, um... I'm gonna leave these here because I don't wanna prime the this is what's frying right now. But okay, so at one point I was gonna be vegetarian because I mean I was gonna be vegan because I knew that um couldn't really eat a lot of meat because it would give me reactions like you know, swelling, inflammation and things like that. So I decided that okay, I'm gonna be a pescatarian. Or I said I was going to be vegan first, really. But some of the vegetables was, like, giving me a little reaction, too. So that's when <clears throat> I was looking up some things and stuff. And I seen that fish, you know, it has good, you know, things about it. It has vitamin B, vitamin D, things like that. So I said, okay, why not get that a try so I can eat some fish as well. So that's what I'm doing. Um, we have here the water that is boiling for the noodles for the lasagna this is the lasagna guys um, it says vegan as you can see there lasagna okay so once that boil I'm going to be placing three of those in there then we have our ragu sauce then we come over here. What's going to be inside of the lasagna? It's going to be this, the cheese. The cheese. This cheese is vegan. Okay, it's mozzarella style. Dairy free. This is go, ve go veggie. Like, totally vegan. I got this from Stop and Shop. This is from um, ShopRite. Okay. Then I'll put a little bit of lettuce and most definitely my carrots. Okay. A whole vegan meal right there. We're going to use this pan right here. We're going to, I'm going to show you how I'm going to like coat it with a little bit of oil. I'm not sure why the top is not coming off. 
trying to get the top off the okay. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. 